Porsche woman for a second time takes it cleanly. Sealing off, they take it quickly. Sarah Goss not back to 10. Out the back door, and then Ruby too. So the forwards making that try. Kickoff taken by Porsche Woman. Turnover by Sarah Goss. And the second prop, Ruby Tui finishes it off. Good kick by Nathan Wan. Porsche Woodman outstanding in the air. New Zealand straight on the tack from the kickoff. Ruby Tui using his step. Now engages, bounce it off. So strong as Ruby Tui. Still going down to the five metre line. No half back there, so Brazier comes in late. Nathan Wong has to drop back, gives it out to Fitzpatrick, who's onto the field now. The late cut by Fitzpatrick, and she absolutely bamboozles him. Sold. Thank you very much. I'll take two. Teresa Fitzpatrick. It all started with the phenomenal take from Porsche Woman on that right edge, and then Ruby Tui with the strong carries, bumps off one and two and three, and then it's Teresa Fitzpatrick that backs herself through that hole, but Michaela Blight, who sold that decoy line, she switched under nice and late, forcing the defence to stick, make a decision, and that allowed the space to open up there for Fitzpatrick. That's awesome stuff again there by Scarrett. Catching Ruby Tui with her hands on the ground. Now here's the guess from Fleming on the outside of Portia Woodman. That is straight speed on speed on, on this occasion. It's Deborah Fleming who comes up trumps. Top try scorer from last season, Deborah Fleming. First try this weekend, but coming up against Portia Woodman. It's not so often that we see Woodman come off second best. That's terrific there from Fleming to back herself and be confident up against a player like Woodman. Now, ball taken forward. Got numbers, Australia. Nice dummy from Polite. A bit of footwork as well. Sweep it to beat Polite. Now she gives it to the speed. Good supporting line by Elia Green. And that's what we expect from Australia Rugby Sevens. What a combination there between Polite and Elia Green. And see some nice service from Pup back there with Dutoy and Yasmin Meeks carries the ball in two hands, commits two defenders, and it's the class from Ivania Polita using her footwork and hearing Elia Green on her right hand side in support as she sneaks through that gap. Okay. Back it comes with a minute and eight to go and booted forward by Australia as Haverlin to Marr. And guess what? This is turning into the Marr show. Away goes Ilona Marr, and this for a hat trick. I am absolutely speechless. A hat trick in a quarterfinal against the defending champions, Australia. What a player, Ilona Marr. The impact that she has throughout the middle of the field, the way she just tears through defense, pumps the legs, and she's so hard to tackle. Brazier with the lay switch, with the woman at the moment, Portia Woodman. Good inside help, though, but she flicks out of it. Portia Woodman. Number of tacklers beaten. If they go to the right-hand side, there's numbers to bear for New Zealand. Goss holds it up for Williams back onto the field. Blyde the speedster on Charity Williams. Blyde, Williams, Blyde. One on one, Williams turns her in and out, but Williams comes back. What a matchup. And the pass given by Niall Williams to Sarah Goss. Good try in the end. Some great rugby sevens by both teams. Look at this by Brazier. Brings it across the field. Great switch by Woodman. And Nicholas, talk about resilience, gets the grip tickler and then comes back to put her body on the line. And here it is, Goss with the cherry on top. Everlyn ready to Sit. roll it in, does, gets it out, rifles it to Doyle on the cross, comes Kelter and a left Kelter. They're all giving chase to Kelter from Alaska to here and down. 
absolute powerhouse, Aleb Kelter. The beautiful switch line run there, and we know she can break tackles. She tears teams through the middle in defense. What a finish there from Aleb Kelter.